Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Adonis Salbright. Jenny Day is working from home as we do our part to slow the spread of COVID-19. Locals today honoring civil rights leader Martin Luther King Jr. Our Adam Klepp was at the march this morning. He has more from the event as well as a message from Yuma's local NAACP chapter president. Many gathered to march in honor of Martin Luther King Jr. It began at the United Fellowship Church and the group was led by the Yuma Police Department. The march has occurred annually for over 30 years. And for Teresa Peterson, it's a family tradition. We've been doing this since I was little. Um, my mother was the president of NAACP, so I'm just following her footsteps. Get all my family out here, show them. You know, there's things we can do to um, treat everyone equal. And while the march ended here at the Martin Luther King Junior Center, the festivities did not stop there as people gathered for prayer and song, as well as to hear from Yuma Mayor Doug Nichols. We as a city and as a nation want to honor and uphold the principles and philosophies of Dr. King. I, Douglas J. Nichols, Mayor of the City of Yuma, Arizona, do hereby proclaim January 17th, 2022 to be the day of observance in honor of Martin Luther King Jr. Local NAACP President Eleanor Sales says this is a day on, not a day off. And she already has a goal in mind for next year's event. Let's all here today remember 2023, remember to be here again and bring the young people. Reporting in Yuma, Adam Klepp, News 11.